it was midnight at the Bumbly Bird Science Lab, and Jimmy Gord was bored. I'm bored, he said. He and his brother Jerry were supposed to stay up every night to see if anything fell into Bumbly Bird from outer space. After two years of watching, they hadn't seen anything. Nothing, he said. But Jimmy wasn't paying attention. Getting bigger and bigger on Jerry's screen was a weird glowing object. It was headed straight towards Bumbly Bird. Jerry tried to tell Jimmy, but he was too scared to talk. Finally, Jimmy noticed. His eyes widened. His heart raced. There was only one person to call now. Bumbly Bird's own superhero, Larry Boy. On top of the Bumbly Bird police station, the Larry signal crackled the light and shot a beam of light into the sky. Elsewhere in the city, Larry Boy's trusted butler, Alfred, spotted the signal and hurried to alert his heroic friend. Master Larry, excuse me, Master Larry. He yelled, get up it, Larry Boy answered, and accidentally knocking his friend to the ground with a mighty plunger ear. Then he too spotted the Larry signal. No time now, Alfred. Duty called. Larry Boy hurried down to the Larry cave, jumped into his supercar, the Larry Mobile, and sped off.